And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Transport Fever. All right, working on our mountainous, mountainous playthrough here. And let's see, we have this line going through, so let's get deep in going. I first would like, before I do anything else, to get this next line uh, going across the town, because it's going to be a little bit... A little bit tough so I'm gonna pull this out and we're gonna drag this out trying to not hit as many buildings as possible so let's raise this up looks like only what two buildings let's see if we can improve that oh there we go one building perfect that's what I like to see because then we can round this bend going into Pine Valley uh, all right oh bridge pillar collision Oh, there we go. Nope. I thought I saw that disappear. Not sure. Doesn't look like it's... Doesn't look like it's doing anything here. Where are we colliding? Um, I'm gonna have to destroy this whole block in order to get this to work. Uh, let's see. Get in here. Let's uh, keep this elevated. Go through the town. Let's point to the side of the hill if we can. There we go. A nice clean bridge through there. And then, I think this is the pillar that it was colliding with. Yeah, so we're going to try to go underneath that and around that. So, a little bit of, little bit of trouble for the... The engineers, the city engineers. Uh, let's just build through that. And then build around this. There we go. Okay, since we can go through there, I'm not too worried about that. I'm going to move this line over a little bit to go under. No, is that going under? Better be. Yes, that's going under. Um, I don't want to keep keep that under. And I'm going to dial this back and then set it not, not to go up so high. And for some reason those are trammed, but uh, that's okay. There we go. Uh, all right, so now we've got a nice little area in here. Let's connect these up Just like so All right now deep den is ready for For its close-up here No, I don't want to start there. I want to start down here just want to make sure there's enough building space in here for new growth. Oh, we've already got, we've already got our little road coming in there. Nice. Okay. Um, routes. Let's get some passenger routes going in here, and we're gonna want something close to the station because we can go underneath the station. Although I don't think we can put tram under there. So uh, if we do this. Can we upgrade? We can put tram track underneath there. That is beautiful. Uh, what road do we want? I think that's... I think that's the road that we're going to have to go with. So I'm going to upgrade that one as well. Does that... Yeah, that added tram. That's so awesome. Okay. Um... I want tram underneath here as well. Okay, so where do we want this tram run? Let's let's solve this problem here. I want to. I need a tram next to the station. Let's run this up. I'm trying to put them on the correct side of the road now. Uh, run this up to here. And then down to here. And we're going to go over with it, over to here. 
around this bend, capture all of these buildings, and then we'll come around and capture all of these buildings as well. So we're going to need tram track um, here. Too much slope. Too much slope. Okay. So, sorry. Sorry, town, but you've got you to gotta work with me here. There we go. Just like that. Uh, now let's try to upgrade. Yes, we can. Get in there. That connects all of that. Connects that. Connect it out here. Connect that. Uh, we're going to need to jot out that way. Okay, let's get an overview here. It, it's telling me two buildings will be removed. It's telling me if there's not tram underneath here. What building will be removed? Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. See what happens. Okay. Yeah, it still didn't. Okay. Well, we're gonna, we're gonna see if the trams can run. Uh, with this setup, and if not, we'll uh, we'll worry about that later. So I'm gonna do no tram track here. I want to upgrade these to not be trams. Uh, that one can get upgraded. Uh, no, oh yeah, I'm gonna have that building be removed because I don't want it. Uh, and I want to not have tram track there. I don't want to confuse the Pathfinder any more than I need to. Okay, so now let's do a new line. And this one's also going to be yellow. So from here to here, all the way around, and then right to there. So that that's the route. We're going underneath this elevated station, which is so nice. So nice. Um, I think that I think that's good. And this is, uh, I think, deep in. The other one was, the other one was the red. So the other one was, yeah, red. So this is deep in. So this is deep. Uh, let's see. Pass clockwise. Excellent. Okay. Now we need a tram stop. Looks like over here is a good place for it. Nice and flat. Let's rotate this around. And put that there and buy some yellow. One, two, three, four. I'm going to do four on this one. So, yeah. Let's go. And I want to make sure that these can go underneath that station. I really, really need to make sure that that, that is a thing. Uh, and for some reason, those are going the wrong way. But they try to they try to distribute themselves so they're all not going to the same stop over and over and over again. Uh, they try to distribute their service a little bit. So I'm going to speed it up a little. And we're going to try... We're going to try everything here. Oh, he's not going to stop. So is he, is he able to go through? I think he is. There's no... There's no errors or warnings, and cars are definitely able to go underneath there. So yeah, trams... Look at that. We've got trams going underneath. Uh, I'm going to take a screenshot of that. That's beautiful. All right. Excellent. So finances is actually making a little money, but I, there's no expenses, of course, because I've got the no cost mod installed because I wanted to, you know, just relax through here. I didn't want to panic or have to wait hours just to get enough profit to be able to record another episode it's just 
makes life a little easier not worrying about that. Um, you know, not worrying about money makes life easier. I wish, I wish we all were so lucky. Um, okay, so another elevated station. I really, I'm really liking these. I'm gonna make this one a little longer because this city, this city is pretty big. Um, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna merge it right in here. I think uh, only two tracks. Let's go four tracks on this one as well. There's no reason why not. And right over. Oh, I wish. Wish we had a a good spot for this thing to go. Unfortunately, I don't think it's high enough. Not really high enough for. Too much, too much free form here. So we're gonna point it kind of down the valley a little bit. Kind of merge it close to one of these streets so we can connect it easily. I'm gonna build her right there, look at that. Another station ready to go. This is Pine Valley, a very neutral sort of name for a, for a city. All right. So there's a road there. We're going to take this road connector in there. And whoop. Oh, for some reason that doesn't like me. Doesn't like me connecting right here. So I'm going to have to destroy that and not rebuild it per se, but I just want want this to come out and through and hopefully this one should be able to connect it does but that's way too high of a slope for a road so we're gonna have to let the city decide how it wants to handle that uh, and then this side can come off no no a little 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 too much there we go a little bit better this is more more normal of a layout than I'm that I'm used to here. A little bit flatter on this side of things. So let's get let's get some good some good feeder roads in for development. Uh, one going across here. Make sure there's plenty of incentive to grow and prosper here. I don't, yeah, we're right on the edge of the map. So there's really no reason not to let it build as much as it wants going one direction there. Nice, normal curvatures. Uh, can we can we grab and we can grab a little a little leader coming across there. And we need to connect this road up to the town here somewhere. Too much slope. Um, yeah, that is pretty high. Well, we're gonna drill it down to here. It actually costs money to remove buildings in no cost mod. Interesting. All right. Well, that that is one way of doing it. Yeah, there's way too much slope there. The grade on that is pretty high. We could do it a little further in. Oh, the city is already taking care of it for us. All right, city. Look at that. All, all new roads. Good to go. I wonder if we can upgrade this road in here. Nah, we can't. The road underneath that is kind of set in stone. All right. A nice leisurely area over here so let's get a track run if we can another sort of lazy track through the mountains here uh, we're gonna want to round this corner so let's kind of merge oh a little a little less a little less mergy and we're gonna want ooh yeah we don't want a tunnel is this gonna be elevated it is probably going to be elevated a little bit 
So we're going to raise this one up, just like we did on the other side. Raise it up a little bit and then set it set it even for the rest of the route. And that will get us, I think, all the way there. Kind of run through skirting the mountain as much as we can. Uh, a little bit more skirting. Like so. I like that bridge type. Nice and clean. Nice edges. I like it a lot. Okay. So we are we need to get up into there. So let's start dragging this one back th into the mountain. And what does our elevation look like here? I'm pretty sure... Why is this going up? We want, to, we want that to go straight through. And maybe a little bit more of a, an angle to it. Okay, right through the mountain. And are we pointing in the right direction? We are. Are we... What kind of elevation are we looking at? Uh, might be a little drop. Might be a little drop between these two now. Oh, not bad. They connect really well, I think. Yeah, there's a little bit of a rise through here, but that's okay. Get a rise and then kind of crest this valley coming into, coming into the new station here. Uh, the tough part now is where to put the depot. Uh, a lot of... Very mountainous terrain in here, unlike the last one. Very, very, very hilly. So I'm thinking right over here is probably the best bet. So I'm going to drag this off. Oh, it has the save. Drag this off to one side and then throw in the depot. Just like that. Trying to avoid as much of this as I can, but uh, it can't all be avoided all the time. So we're going to do a new line from here to here. And this is going to be deep, not dep, deep pine commuter. And we don't want a green. Let's do uh, blue. Blue is a lot easier to see on all this green terrain. Uh, so let's do another train. Blue this time. And let's see. In here. This is very tough to choose. I could... Uh, this is not as long of a of a line so I'm thinking maybe another commuter train because these are commuter trains uh, so another commuter train or we could do TGV too I guess but uh, commuter train is fine let's see what the see the color isn't transferring I don't know why I don't know what's going on with that so deep pine commuter is good to go and there we are. We have a nice, not not nearly as scenic as this route was, but uh, still pretty nice. Look at all the people waiting here already. Look at that, 46 people waiting. That is nice. Look at that, 30 coming in. Oh, yeah. This city has really responded too. A lot of growth and development going on here. We're actually look at that fifty one people. Let's look at the uh, let's look at the uh, charts on this. Oh yeah, we're getting a little response in here. A lot of this, a lot of these drops are when I was placing roads and destroying buildings, uh, especially this one when I destroyed that huge section over here to lay that track. Uh, that big drop was was from all of that. Uh, but yeah, we got another we got a road coming through here. Let's uh, let's upgrade that road. I don't. I don't like having a lot of these weak, tiny roads in my city. 
So let's uh, upgrade as many of these as we can. The little side streets I'm not too worried about. But the ones that look like they could become, you know, main roads, I'd really like to keep keep the uh, keep the roads consistent. Uh, and this road is very bizarre. I'm going to close that one off. I don't know why these didn't match up together, but, you know, it is what it is. Yeah, see, construction not possible because of the other one. So I'm going to take this away. We are going to build a proper intersection on that to kind of... Oh, Cancel. I want to upgrade. Construction not possible. Yeah, again, we've got just bad choices. I want to get this kind of set up before we get a whole lot of growth. Uh, and so that way, once it does start growing, you know, the internals of the city have a little bit better chance of, of working for us rather than against us. So let's get through here. So yeah, let me know during, you know, I don't know how long this series is going to be. It's just going to go as long as it needs to before seven days comes out. I'm also planning on moving here soon. Uh, sometime later this month, I'm going to be moving to a new location. And uh, I'll be able to get a much better internet connection, which will allow me to stream and uh, upload higher quality videos. Uh, so... With that in mind, you know, I might, even when seven days comes out, I might, you know, choose to stream this on a Saturday or something like that. So let me know uh, if you all are uh, up for, a, you know, a stream for me. It'd be, it'd be the first time I would ever, ever be streaming. And, you know, I'm kind of curious to what, what day of the week would be best, you know, what time what game, that kind of stuff. Because um, I kind of just want to relax, you know, talk to some people, talk to the people that have been watching my videos for a while, and uh, get to know people, and get to know what they what they look forward to, and, and uh, what they like, and allow me to just do a better job with, uh, with what I've chosen to do here. So, you know, let me know. Uh, so, yeah, later this month, look for... Uh, a big move uh, and um, there might be a few days where you know there's no new videos and and uh, that's to be expected when moving to uh, a whole new place but I'm gonna try to minimize minimize the downtime as much as I can uh, through all the other things that I've got to get done between now and then so yeah I uh, I'm looking forward to that and I hope I hope to see everybody on the other side of that and uh, get some streaming going. All right, but that'll have to do it for this episode. And I thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.